Welcome to Peaceful Streaming. So I'm back in the kitchen of the house I'm flipping that is from the job that was Morgan's first property. Don't remember what the job was called, I'll be honest. Um, Pets Haven, maybe? Um, but anyway, so last time I cleaned up, I patched holes in the walls. And um, because these really cool red cabinets were in the kitchen, then I decided and that to I decided to decorate the kitchen. And then there was a dining table and chairs here. So I uh, in this stream, I'm going to finish the, the kitchen part, do the dining part. I, you know, I painted also it was like that kind of pottery orangey brown tile that I thought really didn't go with the um you know the 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 the, the um the fridge and the cabinets and everything so I put the new the floor down the black and white tile I put the white tile up there and then I painted that red so anyway so let's see um, we need spices so that so this is gonna be a little complicated because so this because it's near the stove is the um, uh, like pr food prep area so it's a little opposite from what I would normally do but um you know I wonder if I can get this with just a plain white counter because that snowy is looking really um yellowed and it's bothering me let's see furniture i guess this would be on furniture electronic equipment cooking okay let's see so obviously so tabletop white gloss oh wait a minute except over here it's gray so let's see the wood oh my god there's a lot here frame dark red um what's white look no that does not really white gray okay i'm beginning to see a pattern here okay so the base is just gonna be black i think we'll do the handle white steel wood oh, wait a minute so what's the what what's wood black wood okay so that's the front so what's all of this base stuff base primary color i'm not really getting this what they're talking about white steel white. oh okay yeah that's fine white steel is fine um so the tabletop uh gray stone um light what's the light look like i can't remember now um that's not bad actually for this kitchen but you know what that's also getting washed out too so let's do not shiny gray now it's kind of like a graphite color beige gray stone dark gray is it just plain no nope. of course it has to be marble you couldn't keep it you couldn't let it be simple could you um black granite gray marble brown granite shiny gray um sure i think that's the closest So, no, I know I said this recently, but I'm really, this is going to be a relatively quick flip. I know I'm laughing myself when I say it, come to think of it. But it is. I'm going to make this a relatively quick flip because the, the house doesn't really, I'm not really jazzed about it. Um, so, let's see. I'm going to look in kitchen accessories because there's some stuff that often hangs over the stove. And usually there isn't enough room. So, I tend to 
ignore it or sometimes just sell it because it just it takes up room I do not have so that of course has to be way down here um so what if yeah about the, okay yeah I mean we've got plenty of room so let's do that um let's put utensils and do them in just really just light light and black okay and then um spices uh And actually, come to think of it, I think that spice thing would look, that spice painting would look really good here. Now, this is huge, if I remember. I mean, it's a pretty big room. Yeah, I don't think it's too big. Um, uh, I don't know why this is bothering me but I'm gonna put the knife rack back back over here and let's go back to accessories what about this Oh, this is another one that I've like never used. So I guess we'll just do steel and hmm. Well, maybe it's kind of superfluous. Yeah, I think so. Um, Um, oh, and I think, yeah, so I would probably want some of these jars around with, you know, they have like rice and yeah, so like rice seeds, even though you really can't, you pretty much can't see them. Um, and, uh, buckwheat, sure. And, um, what else do we have? Sunflower seeds, coffee beans, nope, sunflower seeds. Um, and I just thought of something and forgot it. I hate it when that happens. Um, I was thinking of that as I was lining those jars up. I, I do not remember now. I'm so annoyed. Um. Okay, so, uh, put those there. What was it? Now it's driving me nuts. Oh, shoot. I don't know. Okay, well, maybe it'll come to me. 
Um, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, so let's look at the the dining table um, and chairs. So that's always kind of interesting because trying to trying to do them all together is now okay. If I don't find something I like just in the regular ones, I do have. Um, I did download some retro stuff that I thought would be cool. Um, there aren't many of the main game ones that really thrill me. This might not be a bad one. We did the legs in... Let's see. Ah, uh, it's just dark on dark. Um, the problem is also is getting chairs to work with the dining tables. That is an ongoing problem. Um, so there's that. That would brighten things up. That's one option. Let's put you over here. Um, cause I didn't find a retro table that I really liked. So that was a, a little bit problematic. Um, so let's do table and let's just make sure that I'm right when I say that. Um, Oh, here it is. Um, I cannot tell what. Okay, the lighting. Is that the lighting that's making it look weird? Yeah, it's the lighting. Okay. So that's kind of cool. Um, so let's move this guy. So, so then the lighting is going to be difficult for that um but it's pretty cool so I'm willing to deal with it okay so as usual I was not able to really come close to censoring it of course not it would be too easy um let's move a little further away from the door Okay. A oh, little further still. Um, okay. Well, since the fridge is there, let's really move it far away. Okay, so it's very tall. I have a feeling this might be problematic. Let's find one of the retro dining chairs and see. Because, yeah, so um, that's what I thought. Um, that's, that's tall for a dining table. And actually, this one is too. But the retro chairs are really short. Um, what did I use? Have I ever done a retro user... Done, done a retro dining table that's a good question um i think actually the chairs i want to use are these because they're i just really like them i like the white and black um okay so i won't even be able to put a table there so when i move them back that one so yeah let's keep it closer to or further away from the um from the fridge just for sake of practicality okay so let's just look for table again um Oh, 
A white one would be good though. Wooden table, marble table, light table. Um, so we could do this one with a white gloss top and black legs. So how would that? Um, it's weird. That one looks tall also. It may be just that these chairs are really short. So that could be an issue. I really love those chairs, but if it's not right, I mean, I don't, the problem is we don't have sizes for tables. Let me just, I'm going to pop this over here. Well, yeah, well, oh, is it actually taller than that one? Or is it just cause it looks like it is. So does this one actually work? So that one actually works. So that's my backup if I don't find anything else. <laughs> Um, and then let's see. Well, it's kind of looking like. That's going to be the best one. <laughs> enormous. No, enormous. I don't think that's going to go here. Um, so, yeah, I think that's, unless I've forgotten about something, I think that's the best one. Um, now we have this one. What? That's, oh, the top is like light. Okay, I see. Um, so that's, that's really high. Is that, is it? Well, wait a minute. It's lower than this one. Well, it's about the same, isn't it? Let's see. It's a little bit lower. But it is cooler, but I just... Legs light, top light. See, we don't really have white. White would be cool. Um, I feel like this is a cooler table. I just wish it was white. Hmm. I have a thought. Oh, it's gotten really chilly outside. Weather's like back and forth. Um, okay, so. How about that? Let's make sure this is centered. Not even close. Um, well, wait a minute now. Make sure the rug is centered. Yeah, it's actually pretty much centered. Yeah. Okay. The table, that's always the tough part. <laughs> uh, oh, you know what? I'm supposed to remind my son to read an email and he's he's gaming with his friends and then I'll finish here and then he'll still be gaming with his friends and I'm not gonna see him I wonder but if I text him now to remind him well let's give it a shot I'm gonna mute for just one second There, I did my duty. 
there's this really nice guy who is is kind of mentoring him in game stuff and game development and the gaming industry um he's got like decades of experience and um uh, a friend of mine who knows my son um when he dropped out of college we started talking about it and she's like oh i have this friend and her friend uh is extremely well known um and but was willing to take the time to talk with my son they had a, a like a long conversation on the phone and um the guy said please you know keep me up with what you're doing and and i definitely would be happy to like uh, have you bounce stuff off me again point you in the right direction if you know if that type of thing and um so um so my son being like incredibly honest was like, I'm not really good at staying in touch. And I was like, oh my God. <laughs> um, but so then um, my friend and I encouraged him to to catch the guy up. It's been like s more than six months. And um, and he emailed the guy and said, hey, I'm, I'm, you know, this is what I'm doing right now, but I still would like to get into, I still am interested in a, career in gaming and blah 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 and this is what I did to try to find a job blah 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 and uh the guy emailed him back right away which is just really generous of him so um anyway but so he took like yeah he took like a a month with the email and kept saying did you send it nope not yet um but also he was as I've talked about he was definitely struggling with depression so it was not the easiest, um, the easiest thing for him to deal with. So, um, so, but yeah, it was really, this guy's, it's very encouraging. Just encouraging that someone in the business wants to talk to you. So, but Lawrence, my son, doesn't want to do. <laughs> we had him do coding school for like after, after school for like a year and a half. And he realized he just couldn't, he just didn't like it because he, he just doesn't have the patience um, to find, he, as he has put it, uh, find a comma in like thousands of lines of code. And I was like, yeah, everyone's different because that actually for me is fun, but I guess I'm a little weird. Um, standing cabinets. I was, let's see, tall kitchen cabinet. What colors do we have this in? Do we have it in like how will that look over here oh that's huge okay so that's that's kind of no that's bigger than I really that thing is freaking huge um I'm not sure that what I'm looking for is going to be here I may actually look at the bathroom standing cabinets Kitchen cabinets for him. Um, yeah, I wonder if one of those corner bathroom cabinets might be better. Um, it might not be. What is that? The white? It looks kind of dingy, huh? Looks like quite dingy does the white wood the white wood looks a little better it's very small though i mean it's it's not exactly what i was looking for how about let's look at dining room stuff um furniture dining room oh they don't have that okay what about living room um with glass doors but that looks frame steel white wood oh yeah that actually looks yeah that's pretty much what I was looking for um yeah that's that's essentially what I was looking for 
Um, I'm going to scoot it a little over because I'd like to put a plant or a paint, uh, plant, put another fern. Um, uh, let's see, plants, small. Um, and I put it in a black thing, right? Yeah. Um, so I put these lights up just because there wasn't enough light. It's a little awkward. I wasn't sure what else to do. What if... Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm not, I mean, they did add some light, but not enough that it was like, wow, we're really in trouble without them. Um, I'm going to divide it into quadrants. And, well, I mean, you know, so have four of them like in a square. So, obviously, further over. Are those lined up? Probably not even close. Oh, they are. Hmm. Okay, so the kitchen area is going to have four, and then I'm going to have, um, then a uh, chandelier over the dining table. Ceiling lamps. Black. Uh, that reminds me. Oh, I was just thinking, oh, maybe I can go for a walk with my friend on Sunday. And I remembered I have to work on Sunday. <sighs> I volunteered. Me and my big mouth. But they were going to be really short staffed. And we have a, you know, like a, um, an event. And... I didn't want them to be short staffed when I could help. Plus, now I'll just take all of Monday off. Um, okay, so we've got placemats. I hope they're, the red in them isn't too light because that would kind of bum me out. Um, let's see, accessories, kitchen, although they call them napkins, but they're like, I wonder if this is just a translation issue because. This says napkin, and sure, it could be a napkin, but, um, it looks like a placemat. Am I wrong? I mean, right? So, I don't know. I mean, they can call it what they want. I'm just thinking that they actually meant placemat, and the translation didn't, like, come through. Um, ooh, okay. Okay, so let's fix the chairs a little. Um, so what light are we going to put above this? Um, ceiling lamps. <clears throat> um, That's a good question. I mean, I could just put another one of those above this. Uh, maybe a white one, actually. Or do something different. Oh, that would be cool. Except that hangs down really low. But that is... It's too much. I think it's too much, isn't it? I mean, it's fun, but yeah, it's too much. I guess if, if I'm going to really do a good job of this, it has to be the same as the others. Uh, it's going to be dark. That's the problem. Um, it's Yeah, it's a little awkward having a 
dining room and kitchen in the same room. Yep. Okay, so that looks stupid. I, it has to be the same light. Um. Okay. Oh, well. Okay. Uh. So one, I don't think one is really going to be enough. So let's, yeah. Now it lining them up is a little difficult because it's like, I kind of want them to be over the dining table, but they really should be lined up with the others. Um, oh, wait a minute. So this is. These are a little too... Oh, God. Why am I moving that? Because you know it's going to be impossible to get this lined up now. Correctly. Oh, my God. I should have just left it alone. How bad is it? Uh, okay. It doesn't look so bad from that angle. Okay. So this one... I think that one needs to move in a little... Okay, so that's pretty good. And then let's do plates, like white plates. And I'm not going to go crazy with the place settings because, you know. Wow. Oh, those are like glowing. Well, what am I going to do? Um... Okay, didn't work. Didn't put it exactly right. I think I'm actually in the way, and that's why that wasn't pushing in. I could be wrong. Um, oh, that looks stupid with all the utensils and stuff. Um, shoot, I have to put utensils on. I hate doing that, but it looks dumb. It really does. I can't, I can't do it that way. Um, okay, so let's do that. Unless I should do, do they come in black? Huh. Okay. That actually looks kind of cool, I have to say. Irritating, but cool. Like, irritating as in the fact that I had to do it because it was bugging me otherwise. Um, okay, so the knife... Yeah, I can talk. Knife, spoon... Um... See, now some wonderful person puts stuff in the workshop where it's like ready made place settings, which has saved me quite a few times. It's like something for one. That's what I always search on. Hang on, let's see. Dinner for one. Dinner for 101. <laughs> Dinner for 103. But so, yeah, this is like saved my sanity quite a few times so I am very grateful to that person but obviously this time um well not obviously but it doesn't really um there isn't isn't one that would match this so okay so I think it's done um I, you know, I wish it was brighter, but that's one of the issues with lighting and it is what it is, but I'm pretty happy with it. Um, 
keep thinking there's got to be something that belongs there. Uh, and I just don't know. No, that is going to bother me. I mean, I think I have plenty of stuff. Let's just put, we'll put the fruit bowl over there. So I think I'll, uh, what I'll do is I'll work on this stuff. So this is going to be the family room, um, which there's one family that really likes there to be one. Oh my God, the cat's just standing there staring in the space, which is kind of depressing. Um, okay, now we've got an extra one of these. I'll just put it here for now. Um, obviously, I need to straighten this. And this stuff. This These colors don't go together. Cream. Okay, a cream sofa. A red rug and a, and I, I don't know how to pronounce it, that, that black purple wood. How, how does any, how does that stuff like actually go together? It doesn't. And I also don't like that black purple wood. So there's that. Um, there. Okay. Family room. So that's fine. I mean, I like the flooring they put down. Um, I don't think it's really what I would do for a family room. Although, of course, the recent family room I did was kind of out there. So I'm not sure what I'm talking about. But um, let's see. So let's do, yeah, wall-to-wall -wall carpeting. Um, yeah, we have so many choices. Um, okay, let's start with a good couch. <laughs> so I guess it's sofa, actually. Um... light light i know what their light options are and i don't really like them um let's do dark but maybe there's a nice dark color that's not like hey let's do red that would actually be good with black pillows white oh okay i'm sold um wait yeah i'm totally sold Um, well, actually, let's keep those white. Okay. Wait a minute. I wonder if we should have it the reverse way. Uh, does it, well, wait a minute. Can we get, we can't get it the reverse way. Okay. Wait a minute. So what we'll all do is I'll move the thingy. Move this thing. I'll sell the lamp because that thing is just really ugly. I hate that thing. That lamp is just, first of all, it's just a very weird height. If you look at it, it's just very, very strange. Um, let's move this light to the middle of the room. Um, we'll put, put this over here. Um, so then We'll put a TV stand over there, and then we can put the gaming thing in here. But like this way. Um, so the floor, let's do, I mean, a very dark carpeting. If we have one. We have, no, not navy blue, we have dark gray. This is black. I mean, I guess it's black. Let's see. Kind of. And then a dark gray. Let's see which one looks better. Um, I'd say the black. So we'll do that. Okay, 
Um, so the walls, I'm just going to paint them white. I think that it's kind of necessary. Actually, and I'm going to use the same shade I've used in the other room, unless I can find one that matches the couch. You know what? I need more light in here. I see what I'm doing. Oh, wait a minute. Does this... Cons okay, never mind. Forget what I was... Forget what I was saying. Um... So, yeah, we do have this awkward situation with the wall. Why is that? Oh. Hmm. I see. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with this room, but I think, hmm. So this is, okay, this is what we're going to do. I'd rather have that wall be, oops, I forgot in the um family room and in the bathroom it doesn't the bathroom doesn't really need it Oh my god, that family has totally dropped out of the running for the house. They're not even showing. I think I can fix that, though. Right now, I don't think they're really... There's not much in the way of bedrooms because there aren't beds. So, that's the problem. Okay. Um, curtains and blinds. Uh, that's a pretty bright red. So, let's try this one. Uh, why does it look like it's a perfect color in the preview, but, okay, so it's not, that's not going to be, that's, that's like a burgundy. Let's try it. Maybe that preview is wrong. Nope. Totally wrong color. Okay, so I'm going to do, um, I'm just going to do a black one. Or, oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, so I'm going to paint everything white. Um, I feel like this is... Okay, this is what we're going to do instead. The problem is then the TV stand is going to be like bisecting the room. But... I'm not really sure if there's a better way to... Why is that? Is that light in the way or is it, or am I just imagining that that should be closer? Let me put that over there. Um, scoot it down a little. There's really no good way to do that, is there? Let's put this in the garage for now. Um, that doesn't look any better. Well, okay. I'm mainly doing this for that family. 
And so it's really, it's not, it's not that I don't care how it looks. Obviously I do to a great extent, but I'm not going to agonize over, you know, it's not, it's not, it's not meant to be like one of my perfect rooms or almost perfect rooms. It's really just a functional room to make the house sell better. I almost never have that family go away, so it's weird. Now this is also, I mean, normally I wouldn't just be painting this white, but again, this room is functional. To entice the family. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, that's weird. It doesn't then open the other way. Huh. Usually they, when you click it a second time, it'll open in the other direction. Did I not finish that? Oh, okay, right. Okay, I have to finish putting the carpeting down. So the family likes, okay, so we need a coffee table. We need a TV cabinet. Um, coffee table, TV cabinet. Okay. Um, okay, so uh, TV. Do this one. Decals magenta. Nope. Candles black. Okay. So then at some point this should turn into a family room. Magically. Uh, as soon as I put all the elements in place, let's see. TV. Put one of these. That's the cheapest one I could find. That's a standing one. Although it probably doesn't need to actually be on the TV cabinet, but. Okay, then we need a coffee table. Um, what else is supposed to be in here? The bunny. Well, I always put the bunny because that one seems to work well. Um, there are like six or seven things that have to be in here. Oh, I'm going to have to look this up again, aren't I? Uh, bookcase? Maybe a bookcase. No, I didn't have one in the... No, maybe I did. Okay. I don't know. Let's see.
Okay, I'm going to have to look this up. I'm going to mute because I'm going to use voice. I can't believe that's I've like looked this up. I don't know. That's the wrong one. Oh no, here it is. Okay. Sofa, coffee table, TV, carpet. So I think I have to do actually just put down. Oops. I think I have to put down like a, a little carpet, like, even though I've got wall to wall carpeting. So fine. Um, Let's do this one. Family room. Yes. Oh, family still has not. Oh, there they are. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to put beds in. There's one bedroom. Oh, well, you know what part of the problem is? These aren't really bathrooms. So let's throw down a toilet. Throw down a toilet. Okay. Um... So let's just put a regular toilet in here. Okay, and that is what? What is that? Sink. Okay. So, um... I think I'm just going to get a pretty basic one. Come on. A bathroom hooray. Ugh, for crying out. Like, this bugs me every single time. Would people really not know to turn the water off? before they install this sink. I mean, come on. Okay, so the fam the, the family people are happy. There is obviously the other bathroom I still have to fix. Um Oh, so let's throw a couple kids beds down here. Oh, there'll still only be one bedroom. Well, Let's see, let's see what we get. Um, uh, there's one I really like. Where is it? Oh, come on. Where is it? Um, actually. Let me slide it there. I think I've been thinking about doing a, a purple bedroom. Oh, there, the family. Two bedrooms are the absolute minimum. Well, we will throw a bed in somewhere else. We will throw a bed in here. Um, where's the one I really, well, I really like this one. Let's put this one in there. Except, uh, oh, yeah, this is too big. What am I doing? Um, there's a, there's like a boy's bed with a stripe. The blue and white stripes are really like, oh, here we go. Yeah, let's put this one in. I mean, this one's big too. Over here. Um, family not, I'm not saying, oh yeah, they're there. They're happy. Okay. Um, what is this? What the? Is that something that fell down because of the thing I was, Yeah. Okay, so that's a sink. 
Let's throw a shower in there. And then we'll do a toilet installation too. Put the toilet over there, I guess. I'm probably going to decorate at least one of the bathrooms, not tonight, obviously, but but I'm just trying to see how, whether I can really get the family to cotton to this. They like pictures, so obviously I'm like kind of falling behind on that, but. So, um, add some showers. Let's just do your basic one. And then just a basic sink. Um, sorry about that. Okay, let's just do white again. Tabletop, pure white, base, white, white, white. Could be a challenge for me. I'll try to decorate this and make it look interesting with all white fixtures. Uh, I think I've tried that before a couple times and uh, okay, so they don't look like they're that ecstatic. Um this says bedroom, right? Bedroom. That says bathroom. They do like pictures. Ugh. Let's put a couple pictures up. But then, uh, yeah, then I'm gonna, gonna call it a day because, um, this, you know, because I, as I said, I wasn't gonna spend a lot of time on this. I'll finish this up. Tomorrow, I'll probably do a bathroom, maybe a bedroom. I like the bedroom upstairs. So, um... <laughs> nope, they didn't budge at all. Well, anyway, we'll keep working toward that. Um... Hmm. Well, I guess I'll have to do a little bit of reading. I mean, it's not essential. Obviously, it'll still sell pretty well. But I, so I just want to say thank you to everyone who's, oh, wait a minute. Oh, hey, Luna. Peaceful. <laughs> hey, Luna. Um, so yeah, I just, I was just about to finish up. This is, um, I did in two streams, I did this kitchen and dining area and then, uh, clean the house. This is the Morgan's first property. And then I create a family room, which did raise that family up as far as our interest in the house, but. They're still in second place. So I guess I have to finish another one of the bathrooms and I don't know. I forget what they want. So, but anyway, yeah, I'm actually kind of surprised I made it through two streams because I'm really sick still. But um, thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. Um, But so I am going to say goodbye because I feel like crap. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, um, anyway, so thank you for stopping by. Thanks to everyone else who stopped by and everyone who's watching the VOD. I really appreciate it. Um, so much more fun when I know you guys are going to be seeing this than just showing it to myself or my husband and son. Um, so I really do appreciate you guys and I enjoy doing this. And so I hope you are doing well and taking care of yourself. And I will see you soon. 
Have a good night, Luna.